Hi guys, welcome to the Fight Age channel. The world champion in the WBA Super, IBF and WBO heavyweight versions of the Briton Anthony Joshua reacted to the words of the WBC title holder in the same weight category, compatriot Tyson Fury, who said that he wants to hold two fights with him next year. Anthony Joshua said that he never thought about giving up the WBO belt in order to avoid a fight with the mandatory challenger for the organization title, Alexander Usyk. AJ commented on the rumors that he lost too much weight before the fight with Alexander Usyk, which arose because of the photos that AJ posts on social networks. Former world welterweight champion Vyacheslav Senchenko believes that Ukrainian heavyweight Alexander Usyk can prematurely defeat the owner of the WBA, WBO and IBF titles Anthony Joshua, who is warm he will fight on September 25. One of the sparring partners of Alexander Usyk, the famous Ukrainian heavyweight Alexander Zahoji, told about Usyk's preparation for the title fight with Briton Anthony Joshua, which will be held on September 25 in London. Former world champion in the first heavyweight, Vasily Zhirov shared his opinion about the Ukrainian heavyweight Alexander Usyk and his chances in the upcoming fight with Anthony Joshua. AJ said that he considers Alexander Usyk the second among the optimal rivals after the WBC title holder Tyson Fury with whom he could not fight because of the contractual obligations of the Gypsy King to Dante Wilder. Friends, before starting to watch this video, I would like to ask you to subscribe to my channel. If you really enjoy the content, then please subscribe to my channel and keep watching the videos. If you are subscribed, then you receive notifications about the release of new videos. You do not even have to look for anything personally. I really want to get 10,000 subscribers on my channel. I am trying very hard absolutely every day and I need your support. Your likes, comments, reposts to social networks. Thanks to everyone who subscribes to my channel. You are my support. Thank you so much. On the eve of this fight, Beras gives everyone who registered using my link with the promo code FIGHTEDGE a 100% bonus just for registering. You can bet money. All the details are in my Telegram channel, but you need to subscribe. Thank you for your attention, now we start the video. The world champion in the WBA Super, IBF and WBO heavyweight versions of the Briton Anthony Joshua reacted to the words of the WBC title holder in the some weight category, compatriot Tyson Fury, who said that he wants to hold two fights with him next year. Let's do it, finally. I heard from Tyson that he wants to fight me. It's a great honor for me to have a fight with Tyson Fury. This is a good opportunity to add a victory over another very strong opponent to your resume. Good luck to him in next match. We'll wait until he is ready to meet with me, Joshua said. Recall that Tyson Fury will hold his third fight with American Dante Wilder on October 9 at the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas. As for Anthony Joshua, he will meet with Ukrainian Alexander Usyk on September 25 at the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium in London. Anthony Joshua said that he never thought about giving up the WBO belt in order to avoid a fight with the mandatory challenger for the organization's title, Alexander Usyk. To be honest, I didn't think about vacation the WBO title at all. And for what? Every fight will be difficult. If I made the title vacant, then for what? So, it didn't make any sense. In fact, there was no reason. I was not expected to have bigger fights. It's just a big fight. With or without belts, this is a great fight, right? Titles make it even more interesting, Anthony Joshua said in an interview. Anthony Joshua commented on the rumors that he lost too much weight before the fight with Alexander Usyk, which arose because of the photos that AJ posts on social networks. Yeah, I kind of weigh 19 kilograms and I'm thin as death. I skip meals. I don't even know why, but I just do it. Have I lost too much weight? No, 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 no. To be honest, everything is different. Don't forget that photos are deceptive. Look at the picture of Andy Ruiz. Due to the lightning, the photos look a certain way, but then everything turns out to be completely different. When people look at me, they still see a big heavyweight. My weight adapts to the training session that I spend preparation for a certain opponent. At the early stage of my career, when I was fighting every month, 
I just running all the time. Now I am specifically preparing for a certain fighters, if you understand what I am talking about. When you fight every month, you work in the gym and train, regardless of whether the opponent is high or low. You are still working on yourself. Now I am preparing for a specific opponent, and my body takes shape in accordance with my training. So my body itself determines the weight, size and shape for the fighter I am fighting. Anthony Joshua said. AJ said that he considers Alexander Usyk the second among the optimal rivers after the WBC title holder Tyson Fury, with whom he couldn't fight because of the contractual obligations of the Gypsy King to Dante Wilder. Bob Arum and the Fury team fed us information that they were ready to fight, that everything was fine. Therefore, we start looking for the largest payout from the organizers, the optimal place to hold a fight during a pandemic. We really agreed on everything. Fury's father gave a good detailed interview in which he revealed this topic. We were close to the fight. We were ready to fight, but perhaps Tyson's team did not inform him about the situation in which he found himself. Since we were ready to fight. It gave us hope. For me, Usyk is the second best opponent after Fury. So let it not be Tyson, but I feel that it will still give the boxing world a good boxing night on September 25. Anthony Joshua said, former world welterweight champion Vyacheslav Sienchenko believes that Ukrainian heavyweight Alexander Usyk can prematurely defeat the owner of the WBA, WBO and IBF titles Anthony Joshua, who is whom he will fight on September 25. It will be a very interesting fight. Many people say that Usyk has no chance, but I believe in his victory. Joshua is a good fighter. It doesn't hold a blow, it breaks. It is functionally I know how it will fit. In short, there can be many factors. I will say that I believe in the victory of Usyk. We all know the strength of Usyk. Speed, pace, functionality. How can you win against Joshua? Impose a higher tempo on him. They say that Usyk can't beat in the heavyweight division? How can it know? Hits, people fall. We will see. It's not a matter of one blow. Yes, he may not have one punch like White or Chisora, who can invest once and finish the fight. I believe that due to the number of blows constantly reaching the target, he can shake, 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 and ultimately Joshua may not be able to withstand the tonnage of missed blows. Due to the combination work, Usyk can win by technical knockout. Although the fight with Belyu showed that Usyk can knock out with one blow. Joshua is still not a pace boxer, and Uzi can inflate the pace quite high, Senchenko said. One of the sparring partners of Alexander Usyk, the famous Ukrainian heavyweight Alexander Zahoji, told about Usyk's preparation for the title fight with Britain Anthony Joshua, which will be held on September 25 in London. Usyk's training process is very different from other boxers, but the fight has not taken place yet and I would not like to reveal any secrets. Although during sparring he works out a large number of rounds, changing the opponent every two or three and sometimes makes short breaks. If you look from the outside, then Usyk, like a robot, works very hard and is completely devoted to the case, Zahoji said in an interview. Usyk is a very uncomfortable opponent. During sparring with him, you understand that you can make mistakes. Just when you think about throwing another punch somewhere and resting, he immediately picks up and does not let you to do it. I have never seen such fighters before, and this is his big plus. I hope that Usyk will knock out Joshua, because I have stood with him and know his capabilities. This fight will be plus or minus similar to the fight with Tony Bellew. It seems to me that Usyk will simply exhaust Joshua by round 9, and then he will be able to do his job. Thanks for watching guys, if you like this video, please subscribe to my channel.